Hi Collective, it's me again and I'm back with another channeled message. I hope you all are doing great today. All right. Today I have I have another message. So um I did a reading yesterday, right? I did uh reading, not the live reading, I did there's this um, reading I did yesterday. I didn't. I did. It was was actually. I think I did it on the thirteenth, right? But I decided not to put it out. For some reason, I was on private, but I I put it out yesterday. So. So in that reading, I talked about how you know. Um. You know some people right some um, um, some um, divine beings chosen ones you know high priestesses high priests you know how you know some people who you know have been somehow trying to copy off of some other people's work how what else did i uh, even talk about in that video okay i also talked about the true bloods right yes so the um the the real ones are going to be separated from you know the fakes yes so separating the the wheat from the chaff that's what i titled um that video as so the real ones are going to be taking over right so but then again in today's um channeled message um what i'm getting is that these people that you know tried to somehow steal off of you you know they wanted your gifts right those people wanted your gifts you know i'm even getting sacrificed those people that tried to you know you know just so that tie people up to you know their south node just so that they can take on their you know destiny and live their own life that kind of thing you know these people they just they just wanted your gifts they didn't know the work that was attached to the gift and there's something else i want to say the true ones the true bloods the real ones the real divine ones the divine beings chosen ones it is what they carry is inborn right it is inborn it is not just something they acquired like i mentioned in that video i said anybody can come online and decide to anybody can learn tarot and decide to you know start reading tarot today somebody can you know learn tarot and decide to start a, a tarot channel tomorrow and start you know reading the cards but there are true ones, there are real high priestesses that, you know, they have gifts, they have talents, they have the intuition, they have, you know, it's in their blood, right? So these are the true bloods, right? So I'm just going to, because what I'm channeling is that, you know, whoever these people are, they wanted your gifts, but they didn't want to do the work. They didn't they didn't want to you know they just thought those people just thought okay if I can steal from so 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 and so you know live their life walk like them talk like them you know say the the same things that they are saying you know do the same readings that they are doing then I can just so but there's there's a part they missed so and that's the part I want to talk about in this reading so is, is the part I said the true bloods you are the true blood whoever you are you know these ones that I'm talking about the true bloods the chosen ones they they are not they are not built to break they were not built to break they were not built to break that's the part they missed right so 
I'm just going to I have some things written down I am just going to read, read what I what I wrote so the soul al alchemy has been completed and these people they live fully they live fully spirit led lives the chosen ones the true blood they live fully spirit led lives they have the holy spirit the holy spirit you know the spirit leads them because their soul alchemy has been completed so they live a spirit led life these are the true ones these are the true bloods so and you know we call them the we can call them the cup courtiers right the cup courtiers then are the cup bearers aka the court carriers sorry the carriers of the holy grail right the carriers of the holy grail they have the holy spirit they carry the holy grail this is a group of people who are at the forefront of ushering the age of the holy spirit which some refers to as, as the age of aquarius or the age of the water water bearer so this is this people's mission these are the ones that were chosen to do this assignment this is their mission to lead right to be at the forefront of ushering in the age of the holy spirit because that's where the world is moving 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 into that's where the world the whole the age of the holy spirit right these people were chosen to do this this is their mission among followers of christ many of the cup bearers right these cup bearers that are followers of christ they are experiencing the second coming now most of these sensitives find it difficult to remain in this stultifying environment of tradition okay of christianity right they are not if you read i mean if you if you if you watch the video i put out yesterday i said i mentioned something i said i came across a video on on uh youtube and the woman in the video she said we are not christians we are kingdom ambassadors we are god politicians god tacticians god you know legislators we are not uh we are not religious right we are not just christians right we are spiritual spiritual beings so let me go on the four carriers so the four these are the four carriers of the holy grail the four carriers of the holy grail all four types of cup bearers have similar gifts but they express them differently they are all sensitive please note sensitive they're all sensitive they are intuitive number two intuitive and they are caring and creative caring and creative so number one we have the pages so i'm going to use thank god i came across this so i'm going to explain this with with with, with um the cup the the court cards um the the pay um the court cards the um does the the sorry guys the pages the knights the kings the queen that's what that's what i'm going to so the pages the pages are the dreamers and sensitives who are quite happy to remain wallflowers they like to serve but not to be seen right that way they have more time for their favorite pastime which is dreaming so these ones they have the gifts of you know dream these are the dreamers they dream if you watch the video i put out yesterday i talked about um joseph joseph and his brothers i mean joseph and you know uh you know his dream dream interpretations you know something like that so the pages number two the knights these are the creatives who don't mind being in the spotlight they don't mind being in the spotlight and they are recognized for their creative talents right so we also have the queens that's number three these are 
they are more concerned with relationships than being in the spotlight and they are recognized for their creative talents they are often found caring for young children or vulnerable members of society that's number three number four we have the kings the kings are the true leaders among the grail folk they help the rest get organized and often speak up on behalf of the oppressed so i hope please stick stay with me i hope you're following so these four types of cup bearers or grill carriers they are not static right a mother whose children are flying the nest may well morph into a king once some time is freed up so these four um these four carriers these grill carriers that i mentioned they are not static so they can change from time to time the um the page can morph into a knight knight can morph into you know so they can change they are not static then the page who has been serving quietly in the shadows may be called on to take center stage with one of our talents if you if you if you watch the video i'm talking about again i talked about how joseph was you know you know was late, later made it was made the um i think chief over egypt or something like that because of his talent because he could interpret dreams so pharaoh you know um upgraded him because of his you know because of his talent he was he was made chief over egypt so that's what i'm getting here then then next i'm going to talk talk about the divine feminine and the second coming so the cup bearers right they serve the light of creation which some call god they serve god they serve god cup bearers serve god and they do so by emulating the virgin mary with a fiat a fiat surrender of her being with a fiat surrender of her being right that's they serve god that's number one then they surrender their mind their body and their spirit to the incarnation of christ many of us who follow christ we are now realizing that we each have you know we have to incarnate we have to in incarnate christ in our own minds and bodies we have to incarnate christ that's christ consciousness in our mind in our bodies you know in our spirits we have to incarnate christ so this is the second coming the holy spirit empowerment once we broke the disempowerment of church leaders no matter how well meaning we became conscious i mentioned in that video i said christ in me my hope of glory right so we are now conscious that we are christ-like right so that's that next i'm going to talk about the sensitivity of the cup bearers so there is power in the vulnerability of the cup bearers right so you would do well as a cup bearer you know i mentioned all the four holy grail carriers the pages the knights the kings the queens so you i from everything i've explained you'll be able to identify which one you are okay so i just i just got a download like the people that have been trying to study you study me my divine beings divine one my holy grail carriers this is the part they missed so if you're if you if, if somebody has been on here trying to you know this is the part this is the part they missed this is the part because you know you are whoever you are my collective you're a cup bearer okay cup bearer so if you're one of this holy grail carriers so there are things there are things that you need to do there are things that you need to do so 
you would do well to have um, a regular a regular practice of purification you know detoxification fasting you know you have to fast you have to fast no matter what you do you have to learn how to fast choose secondly choose natural um, alternatives for your health right choose natural alternatives for your health that's number two you know if you are susceptible to um, physical conditions for which your doctor struggles to find any explanation the best bet your best bet is natural you know alternatives so that's that then because you're a cup bearer because you know because of who you are you you trust you transmit um energy naturally it's a natural thing for you you transmute energy you transmute toxins right in your body at a at a very high rate than you know the average person than the normal person you're able to 16 16 on the clock you're able to transmute energy you're able to transmute toxins you can you know you you can punch those things out because you know you carry the holy grail right so and because of who you are you do not only transmute your own energy right you also transmute other people's energy you can also transmute other people's energy right so your etheric and physical bodies they are both sponges you're like a sponge for toxins around you so you can easily absorb it's why you have to always stay away from negativity because you're like a sponge you can soak in you know energies around you toxins around you so you you have to always try as much as possible to avoid toxic environment you know your environment is just as important to consider as just as your body you also have to consider your environment it is very 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 important you don't stay in toxic environment if you're a cup bearer if you carry the holy will you don't you know stay in toxic environment it, it, it doesn't work for you it messes you up you don't stay in toxic environment so if you wish to serve effectively if you wish to serve effectively you need to create a serene stress and toxin free environment you know you have to always learn to you know stay at peace you know be love and light be love and light and the last message your job is to keep your heart open keep your heart open for divine love to flow to earth your mind has to be open love take your love vitamins morning afternoon night right be love so that that's what you you keep attracting love you know focus on love focus on that that's all you need just focus on love. no matter what you do no matter what goes around you goes on around you focus on love because <laughs> you are protected you're cared for because of who you are because of what you carry so angels have your back they have your front they have your sides they have your top they have your bottom angels are all around you angels are all around you so that's the message for my cup bearers for my you know holy grail carriers for my you know torch bearers that's the message so this is what these people wanted so it is this part this is the part this is the part that they missed this is what they couldn't get
That's what I'm getting. First of all, the first first mistake they made, they 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 didn't want to do the job. You know, you you know the struggle, the stress, the hard work, the suffering, all of those things that you went went through. You know, to to you know to come into ascension. You know, if if you are divine, you you at one point or the other, you've you've had to suffer, you've had to go through you know hard times, dark night of the soul. You you know you've been through hell. So these people, they didn't want, they didn't want that part, right? They didn't want to do any of the hard work. They just wanted to come in and steal from you. They didn't want to do the work. But even if <laughs> they couldn't steal this this part, that's what they could not get. That's what they could not steal. They couldn't. It was. This is. This is going to be. It is. It is. It's not possible for them to steal this. Because this, you carry this. It 